Good afternoon, visitors. Sea Duluth Area Lift Bridge will be lifting to its full height here of 135 feet for the arrival of the Lee to in the next few minutes. So if you've never seen the bridge lift before, I invite you to go outside this time. Right now coming through the Duluth Ship Canal, we have the Lee A. Tregurtha. The Lee A. Tregurtha was built at the U as the USS Chippewa in 1942, uh, making this her 80th season. Uh, she's celebrating her 80th birthday this year. Uh, but she was built by the Bethlehem Shipbuilding and Dry Dock Company at Sparrows Point, Maryland. She measures 826 feet in length. 75 feet in width and 39 feet in depth. She is powered by two 4,000 horsepower six-cylinder Rolls-Royce Bergen diesel engines, which give her a top speed of 15 knots or about 70 miles per hour. She is also equipped with bow and stern thrusters to aid her maneuverability in port. The Lee A. Tregurtha has 24 hatches on her deck, which open into five cargo holes located below deck. Each hatch covering is on the left side uh, of her pilot house. She earned one of the battle stars in March of 1943 when her convoy was attacked by 17 German U-boats in the Atlantic. After the war, she was later acquired by the Cleveland Cliffs Steamship Company to be lengthened and converted for Great Lakes service by the American Shipbuilding Company in 1961. She received a new midsection and her original midship superstructure and pilot house were moved forward. She served as the Cleveland Cliffs flagship until she was bought by the Rogue Steel Company in 1984. 